Hi everyone, today I'm taking you to Busan. Of course we need food, sweet and treats to begin the trip. Donut, squid, Kamtajon with a magnificent view of Kwangari Beach. We went there to see something special. So we went there in November and the sea was very cold, so yeah, we didn't get to swim. I mean, it was winter time, not summer time. Along Kwangari Hesu Yoktang, there was busking performances with singers. <laughs> but there was a surprise. I didn't know about this at the time, but the songs that were being sung were being played tomorrow at tomorrow's show. Then of course we went to do some pictures at the photo booth. And then we just strolled around and went back home. Now we are at Hedong Yongkungsa. So let me tell you about the story of this temple. According to the temple information, most of the temples are located deep in the mountains. This temple is standing at the very seashore where the blue sea water tains black splashes alive just beneath. There is a teaching that Kwansan Bodhisattva, the embodiment of illimitable mercy, is seated in such a secluded place as this temple. And this is the reason why the temple was constructed in 1376. And that is why Ravna Ong, who was before a consultant of the king, said that this is the holiest place we've a mountain at the back and the sea in front. Also, there was a lot of food stalls around the temple and Busan is very famous for its omuk, so fish cakes. I like the texture, it was thick enough, but it wasn't too hard to chew. And according to my expertise, I would say that it was nice. Okay, so now let me explain why we went to Busan. There was the Purkotukje, so the firework festival for the promotion of Busan World Expo and we'll see if it was worth it or not. <laughs> then I'm just going to show you two of my favorite parts. We have the opening. The first one is Fireworks by Hatchberry. When you play the song, you expect huge fireworks and, I don't know, a lot of things. But I think they have done a great job at depicting what it should look like. Then there is this song called Old Cloud. I liked how they showed an interpretation of this song. So, Old Cloud is a giant spherical shell surrounding our solar system. It represents the borders of solar system and so the song is about pushing ourselves to our limits and going beyond them.
so I really enjoy the show and that's what we came for. Day 3 Busan is famous for its seafood, so we can't go to Busan without eating seafood. We went to Chagarchi Shijang. And so you just order when you're on the table and then they bring it and cook it for you. So it's 100% fresh. We got crabs, abalones. And so it was good. And to finish the trip, we finally went to Kamchon Munua Maul with the most famous view of Busan with the colorful houses. Thank you for watching my vlog. Goodbye, see you next time. <laughs>